Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Future Casey stopping by, and I'm here to give you the deets. So, I have some a secret to tell you, okay? So, if you are into a luxurious perfume like me, but don't want to spend the coin for it, I got something for you. So here we have a dossier, and she's gonna be your best friend, all right? Now let's get right into what I'm about to tell you. So, Dossier is a company that likes to make perfumes and colognes inspired by real life designer fragrances. So today, I linked up with Dossier to show you guys um, a little secret. So I chose um, what they call Oriental Cherry. And it is supposed to be inspired by Tom Ford Lost Cherry. And when I tell you that it smells exactly the same, that it does, I will never steer you wrong, okay? So it comes in a box like such, iconic scents, designer quality, no markups. It tells you what the name of the scent is, which is Oriental Cherry, gives you the notes, what fragrance it's inspired by, which mine is Tom Ford Lost Cherry, how much the concentration is, what their emission is, and how it works. And inside is my full bottle of the fragrance I chose. Right here, voila. It's so much, let me see, 50 milliliters, so 1.7 ounces. Y'all, come on now. So, Inside of your box comes a little um, small, I think it's, this is a two milliliter um, sample of your fragrance that you chose. And what they do, something that I absolutely love about their company is they put one of these in here just to make sure that you like the fragrance, okay? Hold on, let me turn y'all back around to me. So they put the two milliliter inside of your box to make sure that you absolutely love your fragrance. So they have a risk-free risk program. So you spray it on yourself, you smell it, and just in case you don't like it, guess what? You can send that mug back and get your refund. So recently, Dossier have a little bit, a few changes, and basically what they're doing is in um, their support to try to save the world and the environment they're getting rid of the two milliliter um, plastic sample bottles that come inside of your um, package but they still have their risk-free um, program going on so they're phasing it out so some people will still get it and some people won't but in the event that you are the some of the people who don't get the little sample bottle Literally, all you have to do is still just try on your scent of the big bottle. And if you don't like it, send it back and they will refund you your money. You can't tell me that it ain't popping now. You can't tell me that it ain't great customer service, all right? So this bottle of Oriental ch uh, Cherry retails you on Dossier. The Dossier version retails you $49. But the inspired version, the Tom Ford... Um, what is the name? The Tom Ford Lost Cherry retails you $350. So would you rather pay $49 or would you rather pay $350? I wait. Yeah, I thought so. So go get your hands on this dossier. And they have a thought, they have um, like hundreds and hundreds of different scents you can choose from. From Tom Ford to YSL to Chanel to Versace. You want it? You name it, they have it, okay? So go take a look at their website. All the links will be listed down below. Use the discount code, which will also be listed down below to receive money off of your purchase. And let's just get into this video. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. So welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the like button. And also leave a comment down below saying that you're new. Um, but if you're already subscribed to me and you're part of the Casey Renee fam, welcome back, girl, okay? So, I am on my way to 
my nail appointment so this is gonna be a nail vlog i love watching nail vlogs i'm not sure if you guys really like watching nail vlogs or not but yeah i love watching nail vlogs so i'm gonna take y'all on this journey of me going to get my nails done i literally completely soaked my nails off i literally only had okay so let me give y'all the backstory i had like five a total of five nails left on my fingers and so i did my um my nail tech and was like girl so okay so the place that i go to you have to have appointments like you can't like just walk in so every time i get my nails done i just go ahead and go on the website and make my next appointment so of course i already had a full set so i was just getting a feel but i broke my nails so i um dm'd her like girl i only got like a total of five nails on and i look crazy can i just soak them off and get a full set so i i normally book a full set or a feel but with elaborate art i i always get elaborate art because i don't like boring dull nails i don't just get nail polish y'all y'all probably know that by now um so i always book for elaborate art and um so she told the owner of the la of the nail salon and so she called me yesterday and was like hey girl Alyssa told me that you broke your nails like you only have five nails left did you want to come in and get them soaked off um and I was like oh no I've already you know soaked them off already um so I'm good for that because they do not they do not um uh, like say for instance you got your nails done somewhere else they don't do nails like they will not fill in your nails over someone else's work also they um what the fuck sorry y'all this man <laughs> this man don't know where he going he almost hit me but anyway anyways back to what i was saying because <laughs> what the heck yeah they don't they don't put feel they don't fill in over other people's work and they don't um they don't take off other people's work like but i got my nails done there so that didn't apply to me but yeah she was just going to schedule me 30 minutes before to get my nails soaked so that i would be ready for in time for my original appointment so i was like no girl i already soaked them off girl because i was looking crazy so she was like oh, okay but uh, because you're getting a full set now your appointment will be for simple art so simple arts their simple art is like you can get a french you can get ombre you can get foils or you can get like nail art on two nails or something like that something like that elaborate is like the encapsulating lations um like bling like you get air on every nail like <laughs> some different on every nail you know the the most extravagant nail you can see you see you look up on instagram you can get that for elaborate for an elaborate set and that's what i normally get is an elaborate set but so i sent these two pictures i'll probably insert them i sent these two pictures to her and her to my nail tech in my dm in her dm it was like are these considered simple because i never get simple so i really don't even know what they really consider simple i told you what the website say but still like you know so i'm like they don't look too elaborate but she was like no these are not simple but for you i'll do it but i was like nah i don't want you to go over time and then um be late for your next appointment so i was like i'll just get a little french plus i'm getting short nails i call them mommy nails um because y'all i don't know if y'all remember but me and dijon are moving in two weeks and i don't want to break a nail so i don't my nails usually are long so i'm just gonna get mommy nails and i'm gonna get the shape that people have been getting recently like the little almond shape so yeah that's what i'm gonna do i guess we'll see what we get i'm gonna tell her do what you want to do just make them cute because right now i don't care i don't really care i just need my nails done and 
I go to we go to Denver next week. We go to Denver next weekend. So I can't wait to vlog that for you guys. But yeah, so I will see you guys when I pull up to the nail salon. They're gonna uh, whenever you get there, they text you whenever it's time for um, whenever it's time for you to come in. So I'll let you guys know when that happens. waiting let me see if I can um, show y'all where Be too far over like the place is right here um I wish I could show y'all the name of the sign or something but the car's in the way but yeah it's 1:54 and my appointment's at 2 so I'm just waiting. Okay, guys. So, they just texted me and told me to come on in. Head in the back. Head to the back and wash my hands. So, let me get my mask on. There we have it. Gloss. This is what it looks like. done as you guys can see and I'm currently in line at Marshall's and um, Home Goods because I want to rain to make my nails look cuter but the line is long so I'm in here and of course I'm picking up things that I do not come in here for and now of course I'm looking at home decor Cause who like I can't go anywhere and now look at home decor. Look at these mirrors. Oh, this is a nice mirror. I wish it was just a tad bit bigger. This one right here. Seventy dollars is a really good price. Let's see. Like I want 
I want like some of these circular mirrors to put in the hallway, like one of them. And then I want like mirrors that are this size right here to go up on the sides of the bed. They're only $30 per mirror. I'm gonna have to come back and get the mirrors for sure. I like that. This is a cute clock. nice. I like that. What size is a queen? Of course, I bought absolutely nothing I was supposed to buy. <laughs> I sent $50 and didn't even go get what I was supposed to go get. <laughs> That's what I do, clearly. Um, I'm gonna show you guys when I get in the car what I actually got, but now I need to go to TJ Maxx to actually get the ring that I want, and I hope they still have it. But yeah, talk to you later. Okay, so <laughs> went in there and didn't even get no ring. Why? Because they've literally taken out the entire jewelry section of this Marshalls and Home Goods. And it's put like a little bit of jewelry like in the line, like where you like check out it. Stupid, I know, but I bought earrings. But anyways, I got these cute little sandals. They're really cute and they're really comfortable. Now this is really why I bought them because yeah, my feet be hurting and I be needing comfortable sandals that are still cute, so. I got those, they were $20. Oh! y'all <laughs> this is a mess but yeah so I got those those are $20 I picked up some plantains some sea salt plantains because I haven't eaten today and me and Dijon are going to eat hibachi when he gets off of work so he gets off of work in 10 minutes so it was no need for me to go get food but anyway I picked up these studs they were ten dollars and they're cute and then i picked up this kate spade phone case because i needed a new phone case i needed to switch up my life but yeah so as you see there's no ring up in here at all so i'm salty <laughs> but i'm gonna change my phone case real quick Cause I want a new look. I wish I could show it to y'all, but I didn't bring my camera. So I'll have to show it to y'all when I get home. But I'm definitely fit to eat these plantains. Dry the TJ Maxx real quick. So I can try to beat him home before he gets home from work. And yeah. I'll talk to y'all later. So we're out to eat at Osaka. Japanese restaurant in Hibachi. That was yours. This is the tropical. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, these are the drinks we got. Osaka tropical. What did you get? Something sangria. Saki sangria. <laughs> okay, you gotta taste it. No, tell me to describe it. You gotta taste it. You can't just 
it's not bad. Tasty. Is it weird? Yes, tasty. I feel like you're setting me up, bro. Yeah, it's not bad. I feel like I need to know what the chalky tastes like by itself. To know if that's what it tastes like. Osaka Tropical. <laughs> that motherfucker's fire. It is, ain't it? But it's, you, do you taste the vodka? Bro, okay, goodbye, y'all. Look at <laughs> Our food looks so good though. <laughs> first bite is good and it's breakfast. <laughs> so, this is the food, y'all. It's from For sure. He's waiting on his steak. Right there. <laughs> Hey guys, so I know I'm looking crazy. I just got out of the shower. Um, y'all, I'm not even gonna lie. When we got back home from um, the hibachi place, I went to sleep and I woke up like three hours later. <laughs> like I was tired because I woke up really early this morning to take my sister to the airport and her flight left at six in the morning. So you already know. And we live 40 five minutes away from the airport and you supposed to be there you know two hours ahead like ahead of time so y'all already know i was tired so we're really not doing nothing today is friday we're really not doing nothing no dijon is uh playing a game right now um we just sipping on a little cognac <laughs> y'all we sound old we just sipping on a little cognac listening to music and stuff like that I'm watching YouTube videos. That's kind of what I do when he uh, when he playing a game. And when I say, okay, when you finna get off, then he'll be like, okay, y'all, I got one last game, and then we'll get off. But we be needing that time apart. Like, we do not be clinky at all. So, yeah. So, this is probably going to be the end of this vlog. Let me give y'all one, one more close look of my nails because I am absolutely in love with them. I don't know, y'all. I think I might have found a new shape and length. Y'all, I think I'm getting too old for the really long nails. I just can't do them like I used to could back in the day, okay? Yeah, I be acting like I'm so old. I've only been 25 for like three weeks. But, like I'm saying, like, these are so cute. <clears throat> Even though they're bright colors, they still could be considered professional. But yeah, they're so cute and I can't wait to have them on my trip and stuff. I've already booked my uh, next appointment, um, which will be three weeks from now. By that time, we will be, have already moved and everything. But yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and end this vlog and say thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell so that you're notified whenever I upload. We need to get these subscribers up. But thank you guys for the 1600 Um subscribers i'm so happy that means i'm over halfway to 2000 which is my next goal and yeah i'm like really excited about this and comment down below what content you guys want to see because i don't want to keep putting out content that y'all don't want to watch you know so give me some video ideas and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys